How to create great UI in five simple steps. Step one, open up Unity. Click on new project. Choose 3D project. Pick a name. Click on... Fuck, I need a name. Step one and a half, go to Google search. Search for cool names for your game. Find nothing, fall into despair. Make up random names based on your game. So there is a slow motion and swords. Slow motion samurai, samurai, slow motion samurai. Name your game slow motion samurai. Click on create. Step two, start creating the UI you dreamed of. Realize that you actually have no idea how to create UI and watch a brackets tutorial on how to create UI. Then create a canvas, start dragging UI elements into your scene. Remember to not put too much work into it because you are probably going to change it later. Step 3. Understand that this is actually not a standard Unity tutorial but a devlog for my new and upcoming game Slow Motion Summarize. If you want a look behind the scenes of how I developed my first mobile game ever, publish and market it please make sure to subscribe to this channel. Do not miss any of the new devlogs. Step 4. Think about what you can do best. If your answer is the same like me, which is programming, don't try to invest too much time in the things that you are not very good at, like modeling, animation or making stuff look pretty at all. Go to the asset store instead. Notice that there is currently a spring sale going on and purchase the asset file that fits your game. Link to this asset in the description down below. Drag parts of that package into your scene, place it in front of your main camera so it shows up next to the menu you just created. Download some animations from the asset store and apply it to your character to make it look more dynamic. Put a nice weapon into your character's hands, position it perfectly. <coughs> Also, make sure to change the layout of your preview window to mobile, so you can see how it would look on mobile. In case you are building a mobile game, that is. You know, if you're not building a mobile game, just kind of skip. Install post-processing effects. Add some depth of field and some color grading to your scene to make your character pop out more. Insert an overlay behind the menu to give your buttons a little bit more contrast. Add some sound to your buttons so they make the satisfying click sound when you press them. Also start being unhappy with what you just produced and rearrange and redesign your buttons from scratch up. Make them actually look pretty and feel good about yourself. Step 5. Make your menu actually interactable. Create a new scene where your game is actually gonna be happening in. Drag some pieces of environment that you purchased from the asset store into your new scene Put in some characters, add in some animations, and you have your main game scene. Now write some code that loads the new scene once you click that play button, and you're done. You have a basic menu in place, you can add new scenes to all the other buttons as well if you like, and that's it. Alright guys, let me know what you think. Should I make more videos in this kind of style, or do you prefer them in a less fast way? Please let me know in the comments down below, leave me a like if you like this video and don't forget to subscribe. Okay, thanks, bye!